Hey guys, before we start the video, it's time for me to make the apology. I am sorry that the mic was not working with all the recent Tetris 99 videos that I uploaded. I had no idea that there was a problem with the microphone while recording that whole entire day on OBS. And it wasn't until I reviewed the Bowser's Fury Tetris 99 episode that I realized my mistake. I don't know if this means I'm going to have to record every single one of those episodes all over again. I have other things that I'd rather be doing with my time, but at the same time, quality over quantity. Anyways... I wanted to upload this episode early as a way to apologize. There should not be any microphone problems whatsoever. I hope that I can try to catch myself before I do this again. And if any of my videos ever do does that, please let me know. Please comment and let me know there's something wrong with the sound. I will fix it. I just need people to let me know. Because if I don't know there's a problem, I'm just going to keep making that problem over and over again. It. I'm sorry about that. Anyways, enjoy this special Tetris 99 video. And I will catch you for whatever comes next. See ya. We the play deep into boss tricks of YouTube. I promised. I promised. My that gosh, that was quick. Welcome to Tetris 99. Except we are going back to old school Tetris. By the way, this is Invictus mode. Uh, I need you to see the home screen. to the Tetris of old, now in 99 form. When I originally had decided to showcase this on my channel, it was going to be on the stream, which I did do. But, uh, that stream didn't do well, and it was very tedious and boring. So, I am finally playing this theme as an actual video with a bonus. You won't know about the bonus until after this match is done. So I think I'm only going to play one match. For one specific reason. Maybe two. Uh, the second reason is not as special, but I'm sick of playing this theme. Nothing against Game Boy Tetris, but when you play over a dozen matches listening to the same mind-numbing music the entire time, it's not fun. So, yeah, I'm only going to do this once myself because I already went through Chinese torture earlier. Plus, Disney speech one was a problem. But, I'm going to stop talking about that finally. And we are going to focus on maybe winning. We'll have to see. So I'll actually start hard dropping Tetris pieces. And there is the second version. Just faster music. Bother playing side B the famous Tetris music. It's not gonna marry us. Hmm. That was pretty bad. You know what? I'll do it one more time. But we're gonna have to wait longer. For me to get into the next room. I got lucky. Really lucky. When I started this thing. 
So, community question, what is your favorite Game Boy game you may have played as a child? I understand a lot of you probably grew up with Fortnite. But for those that did play Game Boy games like yours truly, let me know what your favorite Game Boy games were to play. Please and thank you. Alright, let's do this one more time. We will go straight after attackers. So I don't give them an inch and they take a mile. And we will give this one more solid go. I can do as good as I did with Pokemon insert name here. I think I can do good here. All I did was change the skin. Doesn't mean that this made the game any harder. It's already hard enough as it is. So, here's hoping I can get into the top 10 again. By the way, I'm gonna date the video again. But this is right after I played the Pokemon Sword and Shield, which is what I was alluding to. The Pokemon Sword and Shield theme. I have not played Ring Fit Adventure yet. I have not shaved yet. I want to just get this out of the way now while I'm thinking about it. So I may have to wait on that Ring Fit Adventure till the very last moment. Here we go. Top 50. By the time you're watching this, you already watched the Ring of Fate Adventure 1, so. Hope you enjoy this older video you you've never seen before. I do have some victories, so that's going to help me in the long run. I feel like I'm doing way better than I did the last match. I'm waiting for the moment when I regret saying those words out loud. Until then, keep playing. I'm not gonna go into a victory speech about how good I am at Tetris. I'll just let my skills show themselves. What else am I supposed to say about blood and Tetris? Oh, they said that I played the original Game Boy games and some of the spin-offs, such as Tetris Blast and Tetris Plus. No, I haven't played Tetris Plus on my channel yet, but I'm going to. Never played Tetris 2 for the... I'm guessing NES. So, that's interesting. I'll have to try that out at some point. Okay, so that segment's done. 26th place. Not too bad. Everyone else is level 99. Good for them. Oh, Marino's one star. Cool. I got sick of playing Tetris 99 when I was trying to get the level 99. I'm not about to go for 99 star. Not a chance. But you know what I will do? Change the game. No, I'm dead serious. I'm going to change the game. It's still going to be Tetris. It's still going to be something special, but... We can't do it through Tetris 99. No. So I will catch you in the flash for one last Tetris match. Tetris Effect Connected. So why I do realize I could just play normal Tetris with different BGM, uh, I might get in trouble for doing that again. 
Also, here's the focus ritual goal because I actually ended up playing this last night because I was bored out of my mind. But I feel the best way to end this off is with classic score attack. This is Game Boy Tetris. But for the new age, for this current age, so with classic Tetris, I cannot hard drop. I have to lower the pieces down, and I apparently also learned that I cannot turn this Tetris piece if it's up against the wall. There's, uh, something else that happens later, but I'll, uh, let you see that when it happens. And trust me, it will happen. So, for right now, enjoy these sick beats. Inspired by the classic Game Boy Tetris. Also, no shadow. Rock shall. These games back in the day were supposed to be hair pulling hard. button to try to hold a piece? No, you can't do that in OG Tetris either. So this is much, much harder. Especially the higher they stack.
play the game. I can't pronounce it. This mode was only playable against online friends, but in the year 2023, they released a marathon version that you can play without going online. Well, you can't. You don't have to play against other people to play this version. You may still need to go online. I don't... I don't honestly know. A lot of these modes are just trying to track down your high score, which may or may not compare to other people's high scores, so. I've never tried playing this without being online, so I can't say for sure whether or not that would work, per se. So right now, I'm at speed level 5. games. Um, I believe 25 is the fastest it will go when it comes to levels. Could be off on that estimate. It might just be 20. But I have to look back at my uh, Tetris DS video. And I'm not going to worry about that right now or for a while. You just saw me last night. There was this mode called Virus, and I basically played it on Endless. No joke, I have a Twitter post about this, or Twitter next, but I played for over an hour on that one mode, without stopping, without pausing, without taking any breaks. Until I eventually lost and got a double S ranking. I didn't even know that existed. There was one other mode where I also got a double S ranking. Most of the time I only get B's and C's. A few A's here and there, but since I usually need to take time trying to plan out my moves, I'm not just constantly dropping pieces adapting. So, I'm never good enough to beat the timer. I have Tetris 99 to prove that. Because there are badges for beating 150 lines in just 7 minutes. I have never done that once. Not a single time. I can play Tetris, like I said. But for me, it's important, oh dear, it is important for me to be able to have a little bit of time to plan out my move. There's another mode on Tetris effects that I really want to show off. Probably my most favorite mode of them all, but that will be a different video slash stream. to mention this now 
while the speed is still fairly easy to deal with, one of the biggest things that, one of the biggest differences about Game Boy Tetris is that the pieces stick as soon as they make contact. You do not have time to spin the pieces. And once a piece connects, the next piece just drops quickly. One after another, it just keeps going. So, uh, maybe you're starting to notice why this is actually difficult. I'm about to lose, I can guarantee that. Hey, I got a new record. Didn't even get to the best speed level. Still got a C. Awesome. Uh, but yeah, that was old school Tetris. You should count your blessings. We have what we got now. So, thanks for watching. There'll be plenty more Tetris games for me to try. And modes as well. Tetris in 2023 to 2024 ain't going anywhere. There'll be plenty more Tetris content to come. So, till then, in my next Tetris 99 videos... This has been We to Play. Sorry it says Tetris 99 on OBS. I wasn't about to try to change that. But I got nothing left to say. So I hope you enjoy your day. Take care out there. And I'll catch ya later.